What's going on guys? This is Kaishiro. Welcome back. So we are back with another video. So in this video, we are going to tackle what are the top 5 best tech cards to play on this November 2023 OCG metagame format. So these are the most spiciest and most unconventional cards that you can use to catch your opponents off guard right now on the current format. So these cards are very good on dealing against the best decks or the meta decks right now on the format. So without further ado, let's start. Coming at number 5, we have the Mystical Space Typhoon. So this card is mainly used to answer the Centurion because as we all know, Centurion uses their monsters as continuous spell traps, rather trap cards on their disposal. So you, you can use the Mystical Space Typhoon or MST to uh, nullify those uh, shenanigans or mechanics from the Centurion so that they won't uh, get card advantages from doing so. And also, MST is mostly used if you cannot afford the discard mechanic from the Twin Twister. If your hand cards and deck doesn't allow you to discard one single card that is very important for your game, it is uh, rightful to use the MST over the Twin Twister. And also, if you don't have the deck, the deck that can close out games fast, you can use also the MST over the Cosmic Cyclone because Cosmic Cyclone is pretty much a, a struggle if you don't you don't close out games fast. And also the minus 1k LP is a uh, very terrifying on a game 3 basis if you are going to lose on time as we all know the time rules on Yu-Gi-Oh is very strict so yeah you can definitely play around the minus uh, 1k LP of Cosmic Cyclone from using the uh, MST and also MST is very good on dealing against floodgates like Summon Limit which is very popular on everyone's uh, side deck right now like purely and also other control decks like uh, Runic and Labyrinth are using floodgates as well so you can use the MST to answer them so at number 5 we have MST or Mystical Space Typhoon <laughs> moving towards the number 4 we have Book of Moon so if you are using a deck like Rescue Ace that needs to resolve their cards uh, perfectly well you can use a uh, BOM or Book of Moon to flip face down your monsters from targeting negations like Imperm and Vader which is uh, very uh, notorious right now on the format it is heavily played right now in the format because I do think that we do have a mid-range type of oriented format right now. And we are going to see a lot of hand traps uh, like Vader and Imperm on the format to halt the decks like Rescue as well. And Purely that are very good right now on the format. So yeah, both Moon is very uh, suitable for you if you can afford to face down your monsters. And uh, you are going to play really well against these hand traps that I have said earlier. So at number 4, we have Book of Moon. Moving towards the number 3, we have uh, Spooky Dogwood. So this card is used to halt the heavy combo decks right now in the format. Like Snake Eyes, which is very notorious for tapping recently. Uh, because this deck got a lot better from the Phantom Nightmare. Uh, from the Prisoner of Princess and the Populous from the Snake Eyes. And also, uh, Dogwood can really halt the decks like Pendulum Magician. That are also very good right now in the format. So technically, this card is used to answer the heavy combo decks on game 3 because uh, you can stop the opponent from comboing off because your opponent might uh, consider that you may win using the dogwood on time on game 3 because you gain so much LP from their uh, multitudes of summon on a single turn. So yeah, this uh, dogwood is uh, like a uh, maxi but uh, it is more beneficial on the lat latter stages of the game like game 3. And also rogue decks like Ignister and Manadium that are doing uh, decently well right now in the format can also be halted by Dogwood. So if you have uh, problems on dealing against uh, heavy combo decks that can overwhelm you on the game, uh, you may consider using the Dogwood right now on the format. So at number 3, we have Dogwood. Moving towards the number 2, we have Anti-Spell Fragrance. So this card is mainly used to answer the Pendulum Magician which is very strong right now in the format. Many people are using Pendulum Magician right now because Pen Magi can definitely overwhelm a lot of decks. Probably this is one of the most fast fastest decks and higher tempo decks right now to play on the format. So you can use Anti-Spell Fragrance to nullify that because as we all know, Pendulum Magicians are considered as spell cards on their pen scales. So Anti-Spell Fragrance is almost instant win button against the Pendulum Magician. So at number 2, we have Anti-Spell Fragrance. Moving towards the number one, the most innovative and most uh, spiciest uh, card here on our list. We, ho we do have the Goblin Rider uh, Boon, the max speed. So this is also recently introduced by the Phantom Nightmare from the Goblin Rider archetype. 
So this uh, card is used to topple the purely and other XYZ decks like uh, Horus, uh, Orcus. So the max speed or the Goblin Rider boon is mainly used to detach uh, XYZ materials from the opposing monsters on the field. So you can use the max speed to uh, detach one material from the purely which is very crucial for them. And also decks like Fire King and other decks like Salaman Great which has Mirage Talio. You can use the max speed to uh, detach materials from that. So this uh, max speed is very unique right now on the format. But I do think that it is uh, rightfully so on the number one spot here because it can definitely uh, shut down the purely which is very uh, popular still on the format. Even though there's a lot of uh, decks that are doing well on the format like Fire King and Rescue Ace. Uh, we cannot uh, deny the fact that purely is very popular on the format and it can definitely win you a lot of games going first win the, with, with the ex Lenore. So yeah, we do have to respect the deck right now. So yeah, max speed is the best uh, card to answer that right now. So at number one, we have the max speed. So uh, browsing towards our top five list. At number five, we have Mystical Space Typhoon. And at number four, we have Wolf Moon. Moving towards number three, we have the Dogwood. And at number two, we have anti Spell Fragrance. And at number one, we have the Goblin Rider, Boon the max speed. So thank you for watching this video. I hope you do learn something. On this video, hit the subscription button if you're not yet subscribed on my YouTube channel. And hit the notification bell if you want to get more updated on my future contents. So see you on the next one. Peace.